So the truck race, we had a uh, Johnny Solder get uh, had some uh, got into trouble. Uh, we don't know exactly what's going to happen to him. There's a lot of debate on social media about exactly what his uh, penalty should be if he does get one, whether it's fine or suspension. We'll talk about that. But so basically, what happened was is he was out on the racetrack with a uh, Austin Hill. Austin Hill. All right, Austin Hill in the 16. Right. Austin is taking over the 16 truck. He is a, uh, I think he's a deserving driver, but he's coming Very into a championship truck. A lot of pressure on him to, to live up to expectations of what that team can do. And uh, maybe he ain't quite met that expectation yet, or he doesn't realize he hasn't realized what they're capable of just yet, so maybe he's feeling a little pressure. Uh, but he's also a big boy. He's not a little guy. Mm. And he's not going to get pushed around by anybody, especially Johnny Sauter. Now, Johnny Sauter is a guy that I don't know that a lot of people are going to run into, ever. And if Johnny pushes you around, you just kind of say, hey, uh, you know, that's Johnny. That's what Johnny did, you know, that's I'm not gonna. Start, I'm not gonna get in the middle of that, right? Does, it, does anybody else on this show? Is this me? No, 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 no. I mean, oh. hey, when it comes so, to when it comes, I, I, I'm too biased to talk about this he, one because I'm buddies with both of so them. So we are. I don't care if you're friends with them. We're on a podcast here. You're just supposed <laughs> to talk about your feelings and talk about your emotions. <laughs> my, my point. Um, my question is: is that is that a Johnny Solder thing or is that a Solder family thing? Uh, Solder stigma? family thing. Yeah. I don't think. So. I never thought Jay was that J- way. Jay was. Uh, J- Jay was the calmest probably of them all. Right. So, so I don't know if it's a solder family. I think J- Johnny's just uh, Johnny, a bulldog. just a bulldog. Yeah. So that's a great way to expl- explain it. So Johnny's that way. He's developed a uh, he's a racer. He's developed a reputation to be of, of this type of guy. And so it was interesting to see anyone challenge him. Okay. All right. So, so he wrecks him. He, so, so Austin Hill. Austin. He bumped Austin going into turn one. And uh, we don't know what was happening to lead up to that. Maybe right. Johnny was getting a little impatient. There's stuff the week before yeah. in Texas. Okay. So they had a little deal in Texas. Yeah. Um, and uh, turn three and four, he goes down in there and, and spins him out. Johnny in, puts puts Johnny in the wall. I don't know if he was meaning to wreck him, Ooh, he, but he, he turned him around. Yeah, yeah, he turned um, him around. Yeah, he I didn't said think it. he hit him that hard. Well, he said it. He, he said he did it on purpose. Oh, I know, but I just don't know if he really was trying to wreck him. I just don't think he hit him hard enough for an intentional, I want to put this guy in the fence. That didn't look like a, I'm putting you in the wall. That looked like, I'm going to knock you up the track. And if you can catch, if you can catch it, you can save it. Good for you. Well, Johnny didn't save it. He backed it in the wall. Uh, then the TV cuts away uh, <laughs> to something else, and uh, then they cut back, and Johnny is driving through this guy. <laughs> Cautions I mean. out. I saw this a couple times on uh, late mile stock cars. Once, once at East Carolina Motor Speedway, a little bull ring, and and uh, um, out there in on the East Coast. But um, I could not believe what I was seeing, man. I, I mean, <laughs> unreal. Under caution. Under caution. Some Bowman Gray stuff right there. And everybody started talking about all the, uh, the, you know, well, he, Kyle Busch did it to Horner Day back then. And, that was and way extreme, though. This other guy's done it, and this other guy's done it, and, and there's been varying penalties. Some not pen, some guys weren't penalized. Uh, you know, uh, <laughs> Matt Kenseth was, was set, on, set out for a few races. Uh, Kyle Busch had to set out the cup race at Texas that weekend. Um, but there's other cases where this has happened and no no penalty at all, no suspension at all. Uh, probably a fine and some points. Uh, so that's been a big debate on uh, what should happen to Johnny. Now, I'm, not, I'm it was crazy to see it. Not surprised. Johnny's fiery. He's not going to put up with it. Uh, after the race, um, that, that kid gets out of his truck and says, I don't, I don't care. Johnny can come yeah. you know, talk to me. I don't he, he said, said he's not going to take it, which yeah. I thought was for a humble kid like that. I was very – Proud of him. Yeah. So he, he's a big boy. So, so for the record, they parked Johnny, yeah, they parked Johnny. Uh, instantly. Like, like yeah. when, as soon as he did it, they said, all right, bring it into the garage. Sure. All right. I'm assuming a fine is coming his way. Do right? you take a fine? I, well, I'm assuming at least a fine. At least a fine. Okay. Do you think a suspension's coming? Is this the debate? I, the debate, I, I think, is what should happen. Should, should he have to sit? Yeah. Uh, and so what do you and think? And now that, because that, it, I think if you, um, so if you don't race, if he doesn't race, people are assuming then that takes his eligibility out for uh, the championship, right? Because you you can't miss a race, right? Why no, couldn't you? You can miss a race. Yeah, but you won't. You'll get a waiver. But they, if they're going to penalize him, they can't. They they can't turn around then give him a waiver. Yeah, but he's got to he's got to win. You can't miss a race. Why can't you miss a race? Because you can't. You have to run all the races. It's a rule. I didn't think that was. Yes, sir. But okay. then why is Ross Chastain able to? Because uh, he got a waiver. Oh, he, he got a waiver. Yeah, yeah. Huh. Uh, so you're saying that? But, but okay, so you're saying that there's no way they would penalize Basically, him and then give him a waiver. I don't think. I don't think the purpose. They, yeah. 
Yeah. I mean, is it w- w- what's what's the best for the series? Is the question. Why have, is that the best? Oh, uh, that's no, my he's question. Asking the question. Oh, okay, I'm what's best that. for the series in terms of inte- penalize him proper? In terms of integrity, or, or in terms of entertainment? Entertainment? Yeah. Where do you go? That's I think question. you go with integrity, man. Yeah. Because uh, entertainment's fleeting. Entertainment's here and gone. But we, but the integrity the season, is we're forever. All talking about entertainment. So Inte- it's like, where integrity do we go? is forever, man. That's yeah. what you got to aim at. You get, let's let's hit let's hit the nail that's going to um, help us long term. So. You know, I don't know that you. I don't know that you have to suspend Johnny. I think that's a little harsh. Because I do too. That 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 not only affects you know obviously Johnny, but that affects that team. These teams are too yeah. fragile. Right. Um, you know, cups a cup team in Good in point. a situation like Kyle Busch at, at Texas, or uh, you know, those teams can possibly survive that. Uh, whereas Johnny's, you know, that could be very difficult for a Thor sport uh, to to be able to manage. Um, going forward, so uh, I, you have to look at that too. As far as does penalizing Johnny hurt the health of the team, which would therefore hurt the health of the series? Uh, maybe I think you have to you have to do something to affect Johnny's thought process about what he did on the racetrack and whether he would do it again. Probation. You got to deter him from doing it. Probation doesn't really do anything. Then then you can't suspend him though. So I think you're going to have do? to get in his pocket. Yeah, uh, money. Is a big deal, but you have to go big on money. Yeah. Like you know, you can't you can't find these guys pocket change. You got to yeah. find them something that's going to deter them. Um, and I, I think points as well. Points are so critical. You got to make you got to you got to make him realize that I can't do this again. If, if I'm in this situation, even next year or five years down the road, I'm not going to make that choice that I made because I see that it's made things difficult for me. And um, I think you have to look at how you can make it challenging for him with his point situation with his playoff opportunities, uh, and also a financial uh, uh, penalty of some sort that makes it difficult uh, for him or makes it challenging for him or his team. Did you see Marcus Lamonis? Yeah, tweet? Marcus, uh, go ahead and run that through. Uh, <coughs> so Marcus chimed in and he said, totally unacceptable behavior. Run hard, turn hard, push the limit, but find the clear line between right and wrong. It was crossed, not my call, and it's good that it's not. Yeah, <sighs> there you go. That last part. Whew. So he's upset. Who is this guy? Marcus Lomotis, uh, you know, involved, of course, with uh, Gander, yep. uh, you know, the series sponsor. But, of course, uh, I think it's CNBC, the profit. Uh, yeah. You know, he's he's a pretty well-known guy. Yep. So uh, that's that's a pretty bold statement. So Not only did he say that, but he tagged USA Today, Fox Sports. Yes. I mean, he tagged a few he, he, big he, names in there. He's the tag them all kind of tag tweeter. <laughs> as many as the character space will allow. Yeah. I, can I just say, and I'm, I'm probably in the minority here, but I don't think it. the transgression warrants a suspension. I, I, don't, I don't think either. it does. I, don't, I agree. Yeah, I don't think a lot – th- I think that you're actually in the majority, Mike. I think okay. a lot of people really? don't – a lot of people don't want him to get suspended. Twitter seems well, to but be I, blowing I, up I, like, I, I, like I'm, I'm not, hang him on a cross. No kidding. I'm, I'm yeah, not yeah. bringing in the precedents or anything. I'm talking about what I saw. I have no idea okay. what the precedents were. What I saw – I didn't think it warranted a suspension. I thought it warranted him to get parked, which he was, yep. and fined, which he will. And pro- yeah, yeah. Even though probation, doesn't I don't do know much, anything about yeah. probations, but I'm just saying I think he'll get fined. I, and and I do think that there are uh, is a judgment call on what what exactly he did. There have been times have, when the wrecks are unsafe. I mean, I don't think that he no he just ruined the guy's race. Is yeah. all he did. Yeah. Well, actually. Um, you know, he he heard in a few spots. I don't know. I mean, the 16 truck was going to finish in, just inside the top 10 somewhere, and he right. finished just outside the top 10 there. But uh, you know, the, the guy ended up getting a pretty decent finish out of it regardless. Um, I think that the first thing that happened and then the second thing that happened where Johnny turns the 16 truck going into one and then the 16 truck spins Johnny out, I, I, we need that. Like, we need that. I don't, you know, I don't promote wrecking guys and spinning guys out, but the drama, the the color, the – Boom. The excitement and the the intrigue of all that, we need it. We don't mm-hmm. need to – we do not need to uh, try to divert guys from doing that or try to try, – we don't need to try to um, keep the drivers from acting out in between the flags. Now, when the caution flag comes out, I don't want to see a guy go and run over somebody under caution. Um, but – to your point, we're we're starting the show talking about it. Yeah. So that's good. that's what you're saying. Yeah. You know, we're we're talking about it. 
I know. I, I want. I, I. We need more framing and bamming under the, you know in the race. We need more bumping. We need more aggressiveness. We need guys getting upset and you you know losing their cool and making you know doing things like that. We need that. That's what the sport needs. Um, and it spilled over into, uh, you know Johnny doing it under caution. Now that's the part I think that they should have to try to divert people from doing. Yes, and not, you know, that's you it. Yep. yep. Johnny but, probably agrees afterwards of that too i think he would agree afterwards and probably would have handled it differently if if his truck wasn't you know a wreck he would have went up and got him during the race yeah Yeah. but i think he thinks his race is over i'm gonna go end his yeah it was a case of road rage it was it it's not even a conspiracy it's a case of road rage he went and did what he did impulsively probably wishes he hadn't i I don't know him so i don't know if he wishes he hadn't I, i know that we through the fine, like you said, you're going to want him to wish he hadn't eventually. Right. And so you can deliver that by a fine, a good, good fine. Yeah, I agree. You don't think you mess with the points? Man, that's important. That, you know, brought, point- I didn't even think about that until you mentioned it. Um, yeah, I, you could. Yeah. You could. You could take away his points for that race or something. Or yeah. I don't know. Well, he didn't it. get many. No. No, right. Uh, I don't think you mess listen, with his eligibility. I'm going to tell you something. I'm going to tell you something. You bring up a good point because the points – Man, that does feel – you feel it. I remember when you Hell got dock yeah. points. Man, we haven't forgot – I haven't yeah. forgot it. I mean, like, in my mind, that cost us a championship. 2004. I was, it's yeah. Even after all this time for me, it's still certainly regrettable. And, and that was 25 points. And that's the worst part about it because we were in good shape uh, sitting there in the playoffs. Uh, had, had them covered. I mean, yeah. Well, we were in good shape. Yeah. And – 25 points took the wind out of our sails. Yeah. Like it was, you cannot afford to give up points. One point, much less 25 yeah. in a situation like that. So I think that if you went for, if, if you, there, if you, if you want to leave an impression, you go after money and points. Um, Johnny was parked in that race. In my mind, that's, that's, that's points. That's enough as far as trying to take him off the racetrack any further. I wouldn't suspend him for a race. They did parking after that incident, and his truck was probably, able to continue so he had been removed from the racetrack um so i would go after something that would make him think you know long and hard about doing it doing that again or any other driver for that matter doing it again that's right you're delivering a message to the whole series yeah. i always felt like that the point you know the the penalties and, and fines and stuff needed to be uh stricter and tougher um in in a lot of these situations so it'll be interesting to see what they do 